Let's do it. Can we do a jump into our, our PJs? Do you want to do that? Okay, do you want to do that? Come on, mama. Please. Ready? One, two, three. Welcome to day six. Welcome back, Lee family. It's a pleasure to have you as always. Kick your feet up, take your shoes off, sit back and relax because we got a bang. As you can tell, I'm dressed to go out. Today is gonna be a Christmas shopping video. If you read the title, you can tell. I'm about to go out and Christmas shop for them. They have no idea what I'm getting. To be honest with you, I have no idea what I'm getting, but I'll find out when I get there. I'll get more, but just. I gotta run some errands too. I gotta go to Best Buy for Ronnie. Uh, <laughs> My grandmama gave me that chain. I really deserve better. I deserve to be treated with respect. Why are you me. doing that? Listen, I deserve to be treated with respect. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so, yeah, I got to go to Best Buy for Ronnie, and then, god damn, you can't see. Yeah, I can't see wow, right now. Wow, you can't see. Wow, that just made my eyes hurt. Some people may know, I collect hats. Like, this is one of the new ones that I just got. Uh, and most likely, I'm going to stop at these and grab some hats. But is there anything you want to say? Give me something nice. <laughs> it's uh, a family tradition. I always go super out when it comes to gifts. Yes. So this year's gonna be no different. The thing about it, he tries to go early in advance, like way before Christmas, and he gets in there and have an anxiety <laughs> attack, and he'll grab nothing. <laughs> He just wants the, the feeling of going out. It's very holiday for him. Because guaranteed, he won't be buying gifts until two days before. So. I'm going to go it, give me a little <laughs> Cinnabon. Exactly. So we're going to let him enjoy his moment away from the house. It'll be me and Carter in here turned up, turned up in the crib today. Okay, I'll be back when I get to the mall. Yeah. I'm going to clip to that right now. Of course, I can't go nowhere because I ain't got no gas. Like zero miles left. I just think it's ironic that I flexed my outfit right after I said I didn't have no gas. I did look nice though, but uh, yeah, the ghetto. All right, now, <laughs> hey, I am here. We just pulled up at Fashion Show Las Vegas. It is one of the biggest malls in Las Vegas. I really, really come here. Las Vegas natives know you don't go to Fashion Show unless you really want to shop shop. So hopefully I prove Ronnie wrong and I go in here and I actually find something. But more than likely, she gonna be right. It's always really hard for me to find gifts until like super last minute for some reason. But it seemed like it's packed. I had to park on the second floor of the outside parking structure. So we're gonna see when we get in here. I'll see you guys inside the first store. Every time I come to a fashion show, I like to park by Dillard's. It's right by the Dick's Sporting Goods. It's usually the easiest way to get parking. But I get tempted very easily. And I got tempted the second I walked into this store because they got Ugg slippers, even though I don't need none because I got a bunch of shoes and slippers, but they looked enticing. But none of the ones I wanted was on sale anyway. Almost got sucked into something the second I walked in. I was looking at those Ugg slippers, but I got so many slippers and Crocs. I just got to keep on walking. I collect sneakers, so naturally my first stop was Foot Locker. They had a house of hoops attached. They were supposed to have a lot of heat, but they really had nothing but mids. I personally don't wear mids. If you do, more power to you. It's just not my jam. They had these Jordan Vans. I don't know what those are. Those are hideous. And then they also had these. Personally, not for me. I already checked both of the lids. They are both dry. They have absolutely nothing. Like, not even nothing. <laughs> nothing. But I'm thinking, Carter has a bunch of bracelets, but she don't have no necklaces. So I'm thinking of getting her a necklace. Pandora is probably where I'm gonna stop next. There's a specific bag that I've been looking for for Ronnie for a couple of weeks now. So I'm gonna go into Nordstrom's to see if they have it. I can't tell you what it is because Ronnie gonna watch this video, but just know, fire, gas. It just came out. Black owned company, so you might know it, gas. I just went to Nordstrom's, right? And I asked an employee if they had any of the bags that I was looking for. 
she said they don't have any in store but she has one personally that she was going to return that she bought from there right so that's how the conversation started and then it ended up changing to she's saying that she would sell it to me personally right and then she offered to give me her number and i was kind of just sketched out by the situation so i i really want to because retail is way less than what they're trying to resell for on stock x on stock x it's crazy it's like four times the retail value but i just i just didn't feel comfortable personally going through one person I honestly just didn't feel comfortable with the situation so on to the next one on to the next one wait so right after I tried to get Ronnie's bag, I stopped in another shoe store and they had these Bordeaux ones sitting on shelves. Now, I have no idea why these sitting on shelves. A lot of people are sleeping on this colorway. I personally think this colorway is heat. So of course, naturally, I had to grab these. Then I just walked past It Sugar. I didn't know they had a store inside a fashion show, but they just hit me up to do a collaboration. So big things are in the works. And I was getting a little hungry. And let's be honest, I came in here for food. So they had an ice loves and sandwiches. This is one of my favorite spots in Vegas. I got some voodoo heat chips. They like kettle chips, but they was real like, nice and spicy. And then I got the, I forgot what sandwich it is. It's like a honey mustard chicken with some lettuce, tomatoes, bacon. It was fire on like a cheese bread. 10 out of 10, amazing, I'm telling you. So while I enjoy my food, we gonna clip back to see what Ronnie and Carter are doing at home. Yeah, what is that? What is that? Hey guys, so while Keith's out shopping at Auntie Anne's, Wetzel's Pretzels, because we really know that's why he went to the mall, so he could get all the little holiday feel and eat food. He ain't slick, but I'm going to let him slide. Me and Carter are here back at the house, and I just made us some beef and broccoli. This is my second plate because I totally forgot to record the first plate. And as you can see, I heard beef and broccoli. Can I see mama? I don't think so, pal. I sure do. It's gone. This is my second play. I totally forgot to record the first. I don't have no more rice. We had rice, beef, and broccoli. So I am having seconds. So don't let that sugar cookie video fool y'all because I can't make enough food and cook enough food to where we can survive, okay? And sugar cookies ain't survival mode, okay? I can't live without that. Ah! Hey, what? You screaming with your boogers? Oh, God. Oh, God. So, I've been doing laundry and kind of cleaning up while he's gone. Carter has been a great baby so far. Y'all know how it is being a stay-at-home mom. Some days the kids don't want to... What you want? You know, sometimes the kids, they don't want to cooperate, and then sometimes they do. And surprisingly, she has been... Wonderful. Hi, Stinky. How you Hi. been today? Ah! Ah! you been? Ah! You been with mommy? Dada. 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 We're gonna send you guys back to dad over at the mall. Let's see what Keith is doing. I will say that's officially the worst shoe place I've ever been in, ever. I just bought these, right? They resell them for $350 in there, right? I just got these for $170. He said he would buy them for $160, and they selling them for $350. I get the resale game. Trust me, I do get the resale game. But sheesh, bro. They had a pair of Panda Dunks for $500. They be getting people on the ship. You got to stay away from the ship if you want good shoes. Stay away from the ship. See, and she said I wasn't gonna find nothing. I found her something perfect inside Victoria's Secret. I'm not gonna show you exactly what it is. Actually, I'm gonna get three things. I'm gonna get something right now for like an early Christmas gift, and then I'm gonna get her actual Christmas gift. And then I'll show y'all what I get for the early Christmas gift. Like I said, I went over to Victoria's Secrets. They have 40% off all PJ sets. Well, most of them. So I grabbed a few of those because they look super comfy and Ronnie loves some PJs. And I also got a matching robe because this robe is so thick. It's like luxurious. Ronnie love to kick back and be comfortable. So that's perfect. Update, I got a bag and I met an employee that recognized me. It was super dope. Yeah, I got a bag. I'm back in the robe section. 
The next stop was the first stop that I was talking about going to, Pandora. They've been calling me ever since last year, and I came in here and spent a little bit of a bag. I bought Ronnie a thousand dollar charm bracelet that she only wore twice. She only likes to wear it to like very special occasions. But I'm back in here grabbing some more stuff, and this time is mainly geared towards Carter, but it's Christmas, so you never know. I ain't gonna spill no beans because I know Ronnie watching this. And I got Carter her second hat to add to her collection. Just like that, that's a wrap. I got everything that I came here for. I proved Ronnie completely wrong. She said I wasn't gonna get nothing. I got something for her, myself, and for Carter. So I did pretty well for my first day of Christmas shopping. Now YouTube is not paying us yet. So I'm gonna need y'all to make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notifications for the Lee family. I thought I was done, but I went up for the five below and I grabbed a bunch of stuff. So I got the exfoliating body scrubber and then I got this, I got this gaming set for myself because I do play the game every now and again. And then I got this rear view mirror mount for vlogs. I got this ring light for vlogs, but it was terrible. I had to take it back. And I didn't get this, but they had a green screen backdrop, which I thought was super dope for $5. I did grab this, this LED corner ring light. I don't know why I grabbed it. I already got a ring light, but then I can't leave Caesar out. So I got him a bone. How did I come into $5 though and spend $65? I don't know. As you can tell, I'm back home and I got some early Christmas gifts for Ronnie and Carter to open up right now. Yes! <laughs> Got the presents. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Good, good. Carter's first gift. That's so cute! Yay! Cutie! Now let's get Ronnie's first gift. Give yeah. my stuff right now, right now. Give my stuff right now, right now, right now. Right now. Pick a number, one, two, or three. 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 No, wait, wait. <laughs> Why? Pick a number, one, two, or three. 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 Oh. Three. Talk dirty to me. Come see. Come see. Come see. I love it. Thank you. That was so thoughtful. Oh, I did the best. Merry Christmas. Okay, now I pick number two. Yeah. <laughs> I, I gotta wait. Yeah. Okay, number one. You want number one? No. You can do one more. No, I want for Christmas. You can do one more. You wanna do one more? We can do one more. Okay. Okay, pick another number. You pick. Yes. Satin jeans. Ooh, sorry, Cora. I didn't threw you out of here, girl. Y'all, pajamas? Matching pajamas? Like, that's me all day. Keith always called me old because he's like, what 25 year old matches their pajamas every night? Me. Ooh, this come with that? I don't know how much these are usually, but it was $10. <laughs> <laughs> I had zero intentions on buying these. I collect sneakers and I saw these on the sneaker app and I also saw these on StockX, but I wasn't really like crazy over them. It's a dope shoe, but I got them for retail. And true sneakerheads know if you get a sneaker for retail, you don't pass them. This wasn't supposed to be sitting on shelves. These were not supposed to be sitting on shelves. <laughs> they weren't supposed to get these. <laughs> these are tough. The Bordeaux ones. That's crazy. For 170? I was like, I'm not passing them. I can't, I can't pass yeah, them. Yeah, that's not bad. <laughs> Today was a success. Thank you for everybody that was here. I appreciate everybody watching. God bless you. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bells for the Lee family. Peace out, Lee family. Vlogmas Santa Books. Vlogmas 2021. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. And turn on the notifications for the Lee family. It's a pleasure to have you guys here. Peace out, Lee family. And just know, this will be a very Friendly competition. Oh, it's a competition. You know that. Uh, I didn't know that. It's a competition. I don't do things for fun. I do. Ain't a game. Well, all bets are off. Yeah. Fake <laughs> the glove. It off. is. 
It is for fun, but of course, it's always a competition. This is the first year where we got 